Facebook is suspending more than 200 apps on suspicion of misusing your data. This is not really a surprise. No. Um, this is water is wet news. I mean, yeah, following the Cambridge Analytica scandal, mm -hmm. they had contended, oh, it's not just us. Why are we taking all the blame? They're out of business now. But um, they're. There, it seems that 200 other apps that are available on the site have been misusing people's private data. A lot of them seem to be personality quiz apps. Yeah. And I see that in my feed a lot. And remember, a lot of us, we click on those apps and we do those things and we just accept them. Mm -hmm. We don't read what they will keep and you know, the content they'll keep, or even though they'll say, oh, we don't store your information, but they do. It's like, why do you need my friends list in order to tell me um, what type which, of person I am? What kind of ice cream I would be if I were an ice cream? Or what type of tree would I be in the forest? <laughs> I'd be a sycamore. Like, you know, <laughs> things like that. But you don't need my information for that. You don't need to store my date of birth <laughs> to know, yeah, he'd be a nice hickory. Like, you don't need those things. But then they have the quiz apps, but a lot of the games that people were playing. Mm -hmm. Because again, everybody's just so quick to go, accept, accept, let me get to this game, let me get to this quiz, and not realizing what was store, because remember back in the day, mm -hmm. there was the big controversy about Messenger, where it was accessing your contacts. Mm -hmm. And it was like, everybody's like, why does Facebook need to know my contacts? Because they're going to have voice calling, mm -hmm. so and things like that. But Facebook has to do a lot of scrambling, and a lot of people are saying, oh, this could be the end of it. I doubt it. I mean, we keep, we keep hearing that, like, after the congressional hearings, mm -hmm. after this scandal, after, you know, a bunch of scandals involving mm -hmm. it, or maybe mis- People don't like maybe steps that Mark Zuckerberg is taking, like the 360 view of uh, a war-torn area, um, possibly causing genocide in Myanmar. <laughs> it's a lot. And I wonder, you know, is it possible to actually kill this? Because they've done so many things that would seem incorrigible anywhere else. But people... People stick with it. Because again, we use Facebook for so much. It's our communications app. Yeah. As opposed to text messages, emails. Now they're running, Facebook is running a commercial about how we're gonna try to be better. And it's running on MTV, VH1, and networks oh, like that. What? Yes, Facebook has a commercial like, look, we made it so you all can connect with each other. You can see your loved ones. What? But then you were inundated by horrible videos, fake news. They start talking about everything that happened through Facebook, and now they're trying to right their wrongs. But sometimes it's a little bit too far too gone. Mm -hmm. Now, will it be the, like we were just saying, will, will it be the death of it? No, not at all, because... Again, people keep using it's it. It's really ingrained. It's ingrained in everybody's DNA. What I are we need it for work. What am I going to do? Same here. I need it for work. So what am I going to do? Go back to MySpace? No, because Tom isn't my friend anymore, so I don't need that. I like to work, everyone. Right. So I guess it's we're, it's unfortunate we have to suck it up, for lack of better words, mm -hmm. but hope they improve in the process. Can Facebook or will Facebook actually change their ways, or will they continue doing what they're doing? Because what are you going to do about it? Leave? You won't. Please let us know your thoughts on maybe not Facebook, but at least Twitter.